Hi guys! As promised, we do do other stuff besides work out. Other productive things. Like making rave bras. Like making rave bras. Um, it's like 9 at night and we finally got all our materials together. It took like 4 hours to decide what we wanted. Yeah. Um, Pinterest inspired rave bras. We've been meaning to make them for like 4, four, four years, years now. now. Yeah, so it's, it's finally happening. So this is what we got. Mine is going to be pink and I got a bunch of, let me see if I can find these, sequin letters because... Uh, Michael's doesn't have just regular sequins, at least our Michael's doesn't. So I'm going with black and blue. So um, I got some black sparkles, same issue, they didn't have like a big variety pack, so I got the letters too to get some different sizes in there. I um, got the blue shiny stuff, and then I'm going to kind of put flowers along this way. We'll see if that's actually what happens, but that's the plan. both like <laughs> I'm so burnt it's coming it's now 10 o'clock we've been starting this since 6 be 4 hours later we getting there slowly and now we have so much more to go <laughs> I do Melissa was smart should I do these sporadic balls? things or no? Um, they're kind of sticky on the bottom. I think you should make them a little bit more clustered. Hold on, I'm coming over. It is now quarter to 11 and we are still not done. <laughs> we took on a lot. <laughs> so Melissa has left because it is like 11.20 and she finished her bra and I made the really poor choice of doing an entire diamond bra. My back hurts. I put a blanket down and um, yeah, I'm just going to watch YouTube videos while I diamond up the rest of this and set an alarm for three or so to make sure that I get to sleep. And then I will do this again tomorrow. I am so glad this is what I chose as my template for a bra. I'm really glad. Thank you, Pinterest. Breakfast burrito. Obese to beats. Clearly, so no blogging because I show you guys my burrito after it's over half eaten and looking not so good. But it's, I ran out of egg whites, so there's only one egg white, one regular egg. There's a serving of tofu in there, some avocado, spinach, salsa, and then a high protein tortilla wrap. And don't mind the nails, I'll be it. Yeah, I'm gonna paint those later. I just got done at the gym. I did arms and shoulders today. Um, so I didn't do cardio because we're going to the rave, and I just didn't want to totally exhaust myself because we're gonna be jumping for like four hours straight. So yeah, like I said, I just did shoulders and arms, um, and then I did abs because I want abs. So I'm gonna go shower, eat some food, um, and then. I'll get back to you guys when Hannah and I are getting ready. Right now, I just got to Melissa's pretty late. It's like 8 something else. It's kind of when the show starts, but we don't usually get there till like 9, 9.30. We're going to Uber it because it is pouring out. Almost ready to go. <laughs> my bad twerking. Wow, that hurt my back. We're going to have a long night if that hurts your back. Ready?
friend, we found him. Say hi, Nathan. Don't worry if you don't want to be seen by YouTube. You're kind of blacked out. Blacked out, so. Um, but yeah, we found him in there. He offered us a ride home, which is awesome because it started pouring. Hannah's back there, too. There she is. Um, yeah, it started pouring. That's why we're all wet. We no, we showered already. We went the wrong way three times, but like waiting for the bus. I mean, we probably would be just as wet, but whatever. Yeah. We just wanted to talk about really, really quick. Um, we know like the stereotyping that comes with like people that go to the rave. And we just wanted to point out we're not on any drugs right now. We didn't even drink. We know a lot of people think that um, like... Oh, everyone who goes to the rave does drugs. That's completely and, and it's totally. And that a lot of people oh. at the rave are on very high We drugs. saw a lot of people. Nathan witnessed this. It was his first rave show, and he's not on drugs either. It's totally possible to go to the rave and have fun and not be super effed up. Like, you can be totally sober, dance your ass off, and have a good time. Really Best cardio ever. So we just kind of wanted to nip that stereotype in the bite, you guys, like, because you don't need to drink or do drugs to have fun. You're going to take it right up here at the lights. Okay. Nathan's never been to my house before, so I have to give him directions. Um, but yeah, so don't get the wrong idea off the bat because that's not what we're about. We went, we made our outfits, we danced, it was great. I'm cutting it kind of too long right now, so... We're just going to stop, but we just kind of wanted to end the vlog on a good note. Maybe we'll vlog a little when we get home. But thank you guys for watching. 